Hi guys, it's me, Mystical Dorcas89. I am continuing with uh, with uh, Life is Strange 2. I hope everybody's doing well. Uh, it's been a while since I streamed, and I'm back. So I hope everybody's doing well, and let's get to start it. Once upon a time, in a wild, wild world, there were two wolf brothers living in their home lair with their papa wolf. They all lived happily together, but one day, hunters took their dad away, forever. So now the brothers were alone, and they had to find a new home. They started a journey through the great big forest. The wolf brothers wandered for days and nights, learning how to live on their own for the first time. They slept in the backwoods among creepy creatures and barely ate anything. They eventually found a peaceful orchard and were able to eat in peace. But they didn't know. Hunters tried to tie them up but the Wolf Brothers managed to escape him with the help of a friendly bear. He showed them how to survive and helped them find a warm camp for the night. That's when the Big Brother discovered that the little one was not an ordinary wolf, but a super wolf. That's how they found themselves even further, headed to the faraway land of their papa, where they hoped Find peace. <sighs> Let's see who shows up, but it's okay. I'll be okay. December 1st, 
something else not too heavy though I'm a little tired I'm so glad Daniel took this little girl with us you could try and lift mushroom are you kidding I don't want to hurt her yeah yeah you're probably right Let's leave them. Welcome to Telekinesis 101. <laughs> Please don't kill your teacher. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you're probably right. Let's leave them. Welcome to Telekinesis 101. Please don't kill your teacher. <laughs> How about trying out that rock over there? Just one more time. We already tried yesterday. And the day before. It's too far. I can't reach it. Just... One more time. Fucking clue what happened to Danny. But at least I can help. Can you throw this rock in the river? Oh yeah. Just watch. Uh. Splash. <laughs> okay. Let's show Daniel some more stuff to play with before we call it a day. Sometimes, he looks so scared of himself. We need to work this through. How about that one? I can do it with the small rods, but not the big ones. Oh, stop complaining. You can do this. Trust me. <clears throat> Just relax. Focus. I'll try. Like a boss. You're getting good at you this. You see that mushroom? That was the biggest rock ever. <laughs> Not your usual shooting range, right? How about those cans? Can you fly them all together without dropping any? Sure. Look. Hey King, how you doing? <laughs> That's awesome, dude. You're getting way better at this. Come on, dude. That's just the start. Let's try something else. Cool. You're like Coach Aaron. You're my power. A snowball fight? How 
Are you uh, a, a cyber? Exercise, young apprentice. See if you can stop this in the air. Cool. Okay, but you better not hit me. Like that time you gave me a bruise. Serious. You won't let me, right? <laughs> Try it. Sean! <laughs> you suck! I said don't hit me, jerk! Sorry, I, I thought you would stop it. Serious. Okay, tell him I said hi to you. Tell him I said hi to you. No, I haven't, and I don't have the game, so I don't have the. Ready? This is my first time playing this game. <laughs> no, yes! I haven't. So this what? is my first time playing Life is Strange Two, and I never I played True Colors because I don't I've have the money well. for it. For you, you're a master student. <laughs> hey, that still sounds nasty. <laughs> You're not getting better. I told you. I'm fine. Just a little beat. Well, you need to rest now. Superhero. Yup. Let's do this. Can we go back? <clears throat> yeah. Let's just fill up the canteens before we head back. Yeah. That cough has then been going on you for too. days, Daniel. <laughs> I really don't like that. I hope you're doing well. <sighs> we really nailed it with this two-headed snow ogre. They're really badass. And Musher isn't even afraid of them anymore. Right, puppy? Sorry, guys. We don't take any more guests. I guess not. <laughs> uh, Sean? The family that lived here... What do you think happened to them? That's cool. Hey, Monique, how you doing? They... must have moved out. Maybe to another... We need our fresh water before we go back inside. They... must have moved out. Maybe to another state. But... They left all their stuff behind? I don't know, man. Maybe they live in Florida and only come here every ten years. Maybe they got tired of these woods. Well, I'm glad they left. This is our lair now. I just... Is this all... How are you doing, Monique? And my room. Sometimes. Yeah. Me too. Must yeah, have been a really is. sweet spot to get a tan in the summer. I'm glad I'm inside right now. I love the cold, but it's like really what, what, what are yeah, you chilly. Not my kind of weeds. <sighs> you can't really name birds, right? Probably the name of a child who used to live here. Didn't 
hungry? Not really. Really? I'm getting hungry. Look, Daniel! I think I saw that rabbit from the other day. It's trying to get home. Ooh! I want to see the bunny! I bet. Oh, dude. <laughs> this game's alright. <laughs> Come on, Daniel. <laughs> I'm glad everybody's doing around. well. Moron. I'm doing fine, thank you. Thank you for coming, King Dashi. Thank you, Dark. Oh, and almost forgot and to thank check you for our coming. traps today. Um, Tony. finding that house was a miracle. But I'm afraid we can't stay here much longer. Oh, still no catch? Oh, cool. We really suck at this track thing. Okay, well, where do I need to get the fresh water? <laughs> Dude, come on. Let's find those canteens and fill them up so we can go inside. Whatever. I miss Dad's barbecues. His marinade with the aciote paste, jalapenos. Shit. The family who owned that cabin really seemed to enjoy themselves here. Why never come back? <laughs> I have to try making better traps. I'm so tired of eating. What kind of dog were you, Sandy? <laughs> A cool stray mutt like our little mushroom? Yep. Yeah. Now me tonight. Sean, what is wrong with my traps? I haven't caught anything. Wildlife one, Daniel zero. I guess. Got a final stupid canteens though. Daniel helps me slice wood by holding the logs with his power. I got it. Thank you, Monique. Pretty I'll check fun. right now. Let me let me do it. <clears throat> I'm just checking things right now, and I'll get to it. Where are you going, Pup? Daniel's not getting any better. He needs medicine, and a real house, with proper windows and heating. Wow! <laughs> Sean, look! Mushroom found a deer! So cool! I don't see a deer. Oh. Now we found it. Yay. It's so silent out here. No neighbors. Here we go. The helitanker is over the wildfire zone. Get ready for water extraction. Ranger Diaz. Nice work, Daniel. Glad to see our training sessions are paying off. Thanks to you. So glad I don't have to touch that water. It's too fucking cold. Uh, oops. Sorry. I said fucking. <laughs> it's fine out here. There's no one to hear you curse. Say whatever the fuck you want. Yep. It's okay, Monique. Thank you. You got it. Thank you for your help, though. I appreciate that. I really do. <clears throat> but just like I like to explore, and then I'll I'll figure out what to get to get to. Thank you, though. I appreciate that. <laughs> Little mushroom. 
cold. Don't worry. We'll make a fire. We're pros now. Dude, that cuff doesn't sound too good. Nah, uh, I'm okay. No, you're not. Stop lying. Thank you. You kicked ass today. <laughs> Level up. I did. That was so cool. It's getting easier every day. Oh no, Sean. This is a haunted house. More like Me too. Uh oh, it's time to go over the rules. I told you about showing off. I was just. <laughs> Whatever. Mushroom. Dude, I know the rules. Let's find out. What's the first one? Hide your power. If you spin one plate in a diner, what happens? People will freak out. And when people freak, what do they do? They call the cops. Exactly. The second rule is... Don't, uh... Never talk about it. <laughs> wow. <laughs> nice, Daniel. Because that's usually the hardest rule for you. <laughs> Shut up. And Dog is amazing. Rule. I know. Come on. Um. You can do it. Okay. Um. Avoid danger. Run from Me danger. Me too. This is the most important one. You know why? Uh. I don't know. I mean, with my power, I can help us. Only as a total last resort. How will I know that? If there's any other way of helping, do that first. Maybe if I had used it before, Dad might still be here. Maybe. You can turn back time, I guess. Daniel, you didn't even know. That shit was out of your control. But... Look what happened to the policeman. Maybe this power is a curse. Or... Something. Hey... We have no clue what happened. And it's not your fault. Don't worry, Mushroom. I'm okay. Good puppies. That face! Hungry. What about you? <laughs> I'm always that hungry. face! Then <laughs> let's grub out. I'll make us some dinner. <laughs> yeah. Before she eats us. <laughs> that face, though. That face. Hey, the smoke. How you doing, my friend? Thank you for coming. Oops, forgot my lighter. He's definitely a fast learner. Maybe too fast. We scored with these clothes. <laughs> Plus five street cred. That's cool. How's the OD? Call of Duty. No more batteries. Thank God. HQ. Kind of weird to use stranger stuff every day, but not like we have a choice. I hate it when I hear Daniel crying at night. I can't.
do shit. This thing is strong as a rock. <laughs> yes, mushroom is too cute. This room is fucking cold, so we put everything we didn't need in it and keep it closed. Yep. No more indoor training sessions. We never found the key to this door. I guess using the sliding door is cool. Hello, motel room soap. No way I can give any of these to Daniel. Nope. Too risky. Once you get used to squatting, it's not so bad. Pro That's tip, cool though. That's always great. boil the water. Yes. Unless you want Daniel spraying nasty things on both ends. It feels weird to loot other people's clothes, but we need the warmth. Hey, I put some clean water in the bathroom so you can wash a little. That's cool though, you know, I'm rain. not a fan of Call of Duty, but, you Shining know. with Daniel was the worst. Boyfriend plays it, I don't play it. <laughs> Feels almost good to be cut off from everything. Aww. Gotta love one hit wonders. Yeah. yeah. Daniel doesn't need to see this. E. Of course. He's the town fucking hero now. Welcome back. How can I feel bad for him? Piece of shit. No excuse not to binge read. I'm used to ink, so this will be different. Dead for a week. But at least we got some news. Wonder where Brody is now. Oh yeah. No internet. Time to get warm. <laughs> kind of <laughs> reminds me of Dad's cheesy posters. Thanks, Hank. Dickhead. Just look at Mushroom for a little bit. Can't believe how much Daniel's powers have improved over the last weeks. Ready for today's training, puppy? Sit. Shroom, sit. Seriously, girl. Sit. Mushroom, sit, girl. Are you kidding me? You just don't know how to talk to her. I'll remember this. That's cute. Traitor. Batman. Mushroom clung to Daniel on the first nights. But now she loves her bed by the fire. <laughs> that was cute. That was cute. <laughs> I'm just glad everybody's doing well. I'm, I'm glad. Here we go. Oh. Hold on, mushroom. We're gonna build a fire. Glad you guys are here. Really appreciate it. I know, Momo. Momo! Cooking. Yum. Too bad I can't make a pizza fly to us. I could start Daniel's delivery service. Yep. <laughs> this hot dog man issue is kind of weird. It's 
like, leave me alone. <coughs> Dude, you'll be moving cars around in no time if you keep improving like that. Mm, you really think so? Well, that'd be a bad idea, but you sure are getting good at this. I wonder if there's anyone else like me. Mm, yep. I think we'd know it by now. We'll see. He looks so serious on this picture. I still can't believe he's gone. <laughs> I miss him so much, it hurts, Sean. I know, Daddy. It's okay to think about him. I do wish I had more than tobacco, to be honest. I know, Daddy. It's okay to think about him. I do it too. Okay. Thanks, Sean. There was a little bit left when we came. Pretty disgusting, but... Help staying warm. Poor guy. I guess kids have to grow up anyway, right? <laughs> Tanya must have been pissed that day. Don't blame him. Ninety three. Wow. I'm old. That was old. I wish I helped Dad more with the house chores back then. Mmm. Tough choice. Better talk to Daniel after dinner. Hey, what are you cooking? Oh, I'm sorry. Here's your menu choices. Ravioli or ravioli. Okay, okay. <laughs> so tired of eating the same shit. I just want one slice of pizza. Shoot. Poor doggy's out of water. <laughs> You're the best puppy in the world. Hey, look. Her buddy Raccoon is back. I got my eyes on him. He stole Mushroom's ravioli yesterday. Yeah. Next time we'll call the forest cops. You whiskered thug. <laughs> this thing is strong as a rock. How's you doing, Mushroom? <laughs> yeah, sorry guys, I get into the game and I'm like, oops. You're the best puppy in the world. I'm just glad we found you. I look for a saucepan. Okay. I wonder how far it can go. Tanny needs to eat something after all that psychic crap. Thank God kids used to spend vacations here. Daniel would have been mad without these. <laughs> Daniel needs a doggo friend. Yep. She's so cute. Mushroom! Daniel needs a doggo friend. Mushroom! <laughs> Sorry, guys. <laughs> and okay.
Okay. Got it. I've looked enough. Time to draw now. There you go. I'm trying to draw. I'm trying to draw. <laughs> trying to draw. Pretty good. But I can add more details if I want. Cool. I think I'm ready to draw this. Time to take the pen, dude. There you go. <laughs> Just draw everything, right? <laughs> Come on, girl. Let's get back in. I draw the line. Get it? <laughs> All right. We really lucked out stumbling into this house. I know you did. <laughs> it's okay, Monique. Okay. Welcome back. Hey, Shroom. You thirsty? <laughs> Good girl. Okay, dinner's ready. <laughs> Time to eat, you guys. Time to eat. And welcome back, Momo. Oh. Getting sick of ravioli. <sighs> this is real food. It's better than nothing. I'm just tired of the same thing. Do you want it, Mushroom? my powers but it's just you and me and puppy I don't want you to get in the habit <coughs> yeah who costs like that <laughs> sorry I'm cool hold on I need to show you something. Um, okay. 
gotta show him the map. I think I left it with my books. Mm. Nothing here. Daniel, what did you do with the map? What do you mean? You know what I mean. Where's the map that was with my stuff? Oh, this map. It's in my trunk. Yeah, it's all good. Daniel's been sick for more than a week. And it keeps getting worse. What did you do with the map? You gotta find the map. Where did you put that map? I think I could get used to living like this. Quiet. Okay, come on, doggy. Let's go, girl. Hey man, can you call your dog? I don't exist. Mushroom, come here, girl. What a great team. Hmm. I could do a super cool manga about Daniel. <laughs> no way I'm touching that. Man, I miss listening to music so fucking much. <laughs> Daniel loves his brand new tablet. <laughs> Time to play dad talk. There you go. It's cold, you guys. I hope this episode's not too slow. Daniel! <laughs> Got you! <laughs> Man, are you out of your mind? Oh, uh, come on. Don't be such a pussy. <sighs> Don't you think your power can be put to a better use? Anyway. Okay, I think it's time for us to hit the road. You're not getting better. Oh man. We're almost out of supplies. I gotta charge my other battery. Okay. <coughs> it's just a cough. Yeah, yeah a bad, a bad cough, cough that won't go away. <sighs> Trust me, Daniel. You need some medicine. There you go. Look, here. Beaver treat? What's hey. that? That's where Karen's parents, our grandparents live. Okay. So what? So we can go there and they'll probably help us. There you go. Why do you always force us to run, Sean? Sorry, I had to change my battery, my, my uh, controller. They're family, right? <sighs> As they always for what Karen... For what Mom did. Um... You sure? It would be cool to spend Christmas with our grandparents. Man, they're gonna love you. Grandpa's super cool and... I'm sure you guys will be best buds. Well... Okay. But Mushroom has to agree too. She's part of the team. What do you say, girl? <laughs> okay, when? Tomorrow. 
The sooner the better. We have a long road ahead. <sighs> here we go. We should do something fun for our last night here. How about a team of dice? If I win, I get to draw on your backpack. You know I'm gonna win and draw a dick on your bag, right? <laughs> I don't think so, pussy. Party time. <laughs> he sounds so okay. stupid, Tina. Ready to lose, Captain? What's your butt, matey? Here we go. Just need a six, a five, and a four. Complete ship. You're going down, dude. <laughs> we'll see. Got a ship now. <laughs> there you go. <laughs> Captain's ready to. I don't know what kind of. Oh. I don't know what More kind of. More pirates. Hi. High score. Okay, what the hell is this? Here you go, cargo. How are you gonna beat that? Good luck beating that, matey. Don't worry about that. All right, your turn. Yes, full shit. Yeah, yeah. Good job. He's cheating, you guys. He's cheating. <laughs> I need the score now. Pretty please. Score. Watch out, Sean. I'm so scared. Ah, pretty good. Come on, my turn. Cool. Give me the same. Oh, what the hell? Cheat it. He cheated. it. I wonder what we would have done if we didn't find these dice. I don't know. Hey, Renee. Probably read all these books. Uh, boring. You remember that time I beat Dad at chess? <laughs> you mean we beat Dad? <laughs> yeah. You did help me distract them. <laughs> I bet he would have liked this game. Definitely. He was a great pirate. Just like us. Captain Diaz, King of the Seas. Your turn, lover. Got a ship now. Do you think Grandma and Grandpa will have a console? Uh, I don't think so, dude. Sorry. No biggie. I like playing dice and stuff, too. Whoa. Daniel the big nerd. Getting sick of screens. No way. <laughs> it's nice for a change. But I still want my play balls. Yeah. I bet. I hope Noah's keeping our Minecraft fortress alive. For one, I come. And I win. Do you know what it means? Yeah, okay. You won it. Here's my bag. Mm. Just like that. See. Here, what do you think? Is that mushroom? Yes! I know I'm not as good as you, but... <laughs> nah, it's... How are you, Renee? Really cool. How is everybody in the chat doing? Thanks. So, let's do another one? Yeah, okay. I'm gonna beat you this time. It's getting late, though. So, let's make it short. Okay. Mushrooms growing up so fast. Really? I don't see much difference. Well, That's good. I'm she's still okay. tiny dot. It's cold. But I can tell she's getting older. And smart. You're a smart girl. 
I... <laughs> She's so cute. I love her forever. Yay. No full ship. No score. Your turn, lover. <laughs> Got a ship now. Thank you. I need a captain. Come on. All right. Everyone on deck. I need the score now. Pretty please. Score. Watch out, Sean. I'm so scared. My turn now. Be ready to lose. Okay. Got what the hell? Okay. Give me a six. Still incomplete? Jeez. Sounds like a no score. This is my last chance. Don't fail me. Yay. No full ship. No score. The dice are yours. What? Come on. Sit. Please. Sit. All right. Everyone on deck. So, let's do another one? It's bedtime. Gotta get up early. I'm gonna finish my comic book. She has to pee. Okay, okay. Oh no. I'll take her out for a walk. You're going to smoke. It smells like ass. You're right. Don't smoke. But... It's our last night, so we can do anything. All right, all right. I heard you the first time, dude. are smoking now these teens now and these days are vaping the hell got a long way I know that for sure a dumb
Like time to go. Hold on, you guys. I get my hey, kitty in. How are you doing? It sucks. I'm coming. Be right there. Right, right there. I'll be right there, Daniel. I'll be right there. Be right there, Daniel. Hold on. <laughs> So, what's going on? It doesn't fit in. There's too much stuff. It's fucking bullshit. Hey, cool down. It's gonna be okay. I know. But... What did you pack in? What the f... Dude, you can't fit the whole room in. Don't worry. Your super strong big brother can help. Awesome. Thanks, Sean. Well, looks like we're almost set. Where's Mushroom? Still peeing, I guess? I'm oh, gonna no. check what she's up to. Uh -oh. Okay, I'll fill up our bottles and I'll catch up with you guys. I have a bad feeling. I have a bad feeling. Very bad feeling. Okay, all done. Where the hell is he? I have a bad feeling about this. I have a bad feeling, you guys. Daniel. A really, really bad feeling. Really bad feeling. Daniel! Hey, you out here? Daniel! I have a bad feeling. Where is he? We have a two day walk ahead of us. Better get going. No. I have to find Daniel and Mushroom. Daniel? Where are you? What the fuck happened here? Oh no. Oh no. Dude, what are you doing? I have a bad feeling about this. A really, really bad Something's feeling, you right. guys.
Daniel. Really bad feeling. So follow the blood, I guess. It's okay, welcome back. Hey, what are you up to? Not good. No. 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 Uh uh. Daniel? Mushroom's gonna die. What the hell? I wasn't ready for that. I wasn't ready for that. What the hell? <laughs> what the hell? Yeah. What the hell? <laughs> Rest in peace, mushroom. Here. You should do it. Is that it? The hell? Well, unless, unless you want to say wanna something. something. Uh, goodbye, Mushroom. You were such a good puppy. I'll always remember. Running through the snow. Yeah. What the hell? And you snuggled. <laughs> and 
I'll never forget you. Never. <laughs> Thank you, Mushroom. For looking after us in these woods. You won't be forgotten. He will look after her. It is not even the like final episodes. Episode two is this is already giving me cry. What the hell? No what the hell, It'll you guys? Today. Really? Okay. We should go. It's getting late. I'm not a monster. I'm sorry I killed the cat. I don't know what I was thinking. I don't know what you mean. If only I could. I know. Come on, buddy. I don't know if you're talking about the game or me. I'm not no monster. I don't understand. Such thing. <laughs> after our mushroom. So long, my dudes. <laughs> I was like, I didn't do anything. nature have to do that? Why did nature have to do that? I didn't like it. <laughs> Hi, Kevin. I know I'm not a monster. Call her Momo, Kevin. Oh, 
жизни. Beaver Creek. They made it to their grandparents' house. Well, to the city that they're in. Everybody's doing well in the chat. I hope everything is doing well. I hope your week is okay. You know. <coughs> we made it, Daniel. The Reynolds. It's been a long time since I was here. When was that? Before you were born. The Reynolds. Hmm. Their mom? Yeah. Come here. Let me check you out. Claire likes everything super clean. Dad said she got pissed because he let me bring a snowball in the house. We don't want to look like total pigs. Try the ring again. I'm sorry, we don't want any of you. Hello, Claire. Sean? Oh my. Is that Daniel? What's going on out here? I heard. Look who's here. After all this time. What the hell are you doing here? Stephen, watch your mouth. Well, it's kind of a long story. <coughs> oh, you poor thing. You know he's sick, right? Yeah, but... Okay, inside. Both of you. There you go. Okay. <laughs> okay. <coughs> I'm doing okay in yourself. Sorry to hear that, Kevin. Hey, is it uh, warm enough for you? Oh, yeah. Feels nice and toasty. I gave Daniel some cough medicine, but you should have taken better care of him. He could have been worse. You were lucky. Stephen, may I talk to you for a second? I remember that. I think. Oh, shit. I'm so hungry, my belly hurts. I don't know. It's good to be inside. Finally. I just hope. Fuck. Did I make a mistake coming here? Mm, I guess.
feels so awkward to be here. Sorry to hear that, Kevin. I guess I gotta wait. Okay. All right, Stephen. Oh, Lord. Are you all right, honey? You want more tea? Thanks. I'm good. Uh, well, Sean, uh, do you want to talk about? Uh, the police called us a few weeks ago. They're looking for you as suspects in a homicide and for assault and robbery in a gas station. Now, if you want us to help you, did you hurt that police officer in Seattle? Seriously? You really think I killed that cop? No, don't, don't get mad. Sean, we have to ask. We only know what we saw in the news. All I know is that he shot dead. And now he's gone. Oh, sweetie. We are so sorry for what happened to your father, but why did you run away if you're innocent? I didn't want Daniel to see Dad. Like that. I felt like I had to protect him. Hope I chose the right answer. I understand, but... You know the police would separate us. Maybe forever. Daniel would end up in foster care. You can't be sure, Sean. Anyway, at least you've managed to come here alive. We're glad you two are okay. Whew. I was ready. I hate to think what could have happened to both of you. You need to think of long-term solutions now. I tried. I swear. But I can't do everything. Just checking everything, right, you guys? So, what are your plans? Go down to Mexico, to Puerto Lobos. Dad has a family house there. Sean, you can't run away from the law like, like fugitives. How can you look out for your brother if you're both running from the police? You two are gonna stay with us. Oh, Stephen. Maybe we should... After your mother left, your dad never really wanted us in your life. I can't blame him. But you're still part of our family. Oh, okay. So it's mom's parents. Okay. Seriously? That's really nice, Stephen. Thank you. Okay. The but grandma's kind of a jerk. <laughs> no mess. No she noise. she seems like that. Or no service. The biggest rule is keep your heads low around here. <laughs> You're the biggest. <laughs> and nosy. We can stay? Serious? Awesome! Ooh, Sean, guess what? There's a huge model train upstairs. Hey, you're supposed to be resting, young man. <laughs> yeah, yes he is. <laughs> but he seems better already. Anyway, you and Daniel will stay here. At least until Daniel's better. We'll... 
see what happens next. I know. It was funny. She straight oh, up said, she, you just straight up said the I truth. The grandma's a jerk. <laughs> The grandma's a jerk. <laughs> How do you How feel? Do you feel? <laughs> Super well. <laughs> it's nice and warm in here. And the food? Yum. Yeah. Feels good. Feeling better? Yeah. You look cozy. Yeah. Well, that's their that's their grandma. I love that's their grandma. Mm. Thanks, grandma. Good. <coughs> Your temperature is down. I'm way better now. You still need to take it easy. How about if we say a little prayer and, and give thanks? It's like a bedtime story, right? Well, this is a bit like this. Yes. Except the story comes from. Up there. <laughs> the ceiling. So are we ready to pray? <laughs> Just follow my lead. Respect, you guys. Sure. We need all the help we can get. <laughs> can you ask the blessed dad? And Sean. Um, and Mushroom. And you and Grandpa. And, uh... Everybody else. Oh my, you are so sweet. Should I take my hand, son? Thank you, Lord, for bringing Sean and Daniel safe and sound into our house. Take care of Esteban and um, Mushroom. Please give us the strength to get over the hardships of the past and the trials I don't condone Christianity you guys Amen 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 Okay It's bedtime Try to get some rest You still need it And no roughhousing in here No worries We're too tired Good night Oh and Thanks again Good night, Grandma. <laughs> and they're like, I can't sleep. Feels so nice to have a bed again. And the bathroom. I hear that. Plus, you don't smell anymore. Whatever. Well, Claire seems pretty caring. And nice. I guess Steven is too. I hope we'll be fine here. I think so. And the more important thing is you'll have time to get better. Sean? Are we in Mom's old room? Nah, I don't think this is the one. Not from what I remember. But it's been a while. Could we check it out tomorrow? Maybe find some of her stuff? Why would you want to do that? I just don't know anything about her. Daniel, I understand. But we need to focus on where we are now and where we're off to. Mom left us. She made her choice. We gotta make our <coughs> Excuse me. <coughs> Excuse me. You know what I mean? Yeah. Uh, I guess. Hey, man. You've been doing so great with your... Well... You know. I was wondering... How do you do it? Uh... I don't know. I concentrate in... It just happens. So... It makes you feel strong? Like... Special and mighty? I don't think that. 
I don't know how I feel. Why are you asking? Never mind. Just curious. Forget I asked anything. Anyway, remember the rules, right? We really don't want Claire or Stephen to start asking questions. I know, I know. Don't show, don't talk. Just keep that in mind and everything should be fine. Sleep tight. No cup. Excuse me. Beaver Creek, Oregon, one week later. Ninety-seven. Okay. Now time Man, to rock. I could sleep all day long in this bed, but I'm way too hungry. Wonder if Brody noticed his hula girl was missing. Wonder if Brody noticed his hula girl was missing. Excuse me. That's cool. Claire dug this up for us. That's such a baller in his suit. This is pretty good so far. I love that Steven only has crime and train books. That's a cool memento of our secret dabbing in the woods. Thanks, Claire, but I will never wear these things. Tanya was training his precision with these. Fucking awesome. <laughs> Daniel looks like a total thug in his new pajamas. Can't believe we actually spent a month out there by ourselves and survived. It happened. Pretty badass. Oh, sorry. My nose is ready and itchy. 
I sneezed a couple of times. <laughs> Excuse me. All right. I'm allowed to go out now. Sean! Finally. Sean, are you awake? Breakfast almost done, so come down when you're ready, okay? Okay! <sighs> What's up? Ah, look who's here. But uh, you're too late for the 915 Express. Um, it's okay. I'll take the next one. It will leave after breakfast. Don't be late this time. I won't. <sighs> Better not sneak in. They won't like it. It's been locked ever since we got here. And I kind of don't give a fuck. <laughs> oh, man. The mom, those probably their moms How are. How did we survive for weeks out there with no hot water? Saw some teeth in there a few nights ago. I wonder if it's Claire's or Steven's. I used to hate brushing my teeth. Just like Daniel. Now I can't get enough toothpaste. Wow. They sure did stock us up on clothes for the winter. Hope I'll never have to hold on to a bar to take a shit. They have so many pills and stuff to take. Sucks to be old. It's crazy how everything is neat and tidy here. Quite the change from our last home. <sighs> Fuck. I broke this thing like 10 years ago. I can't believe they fixed it. And kept it. Better hit the kitchen. Oh my, look who's awake. Good morning. Daniel, mm. breakfast time. Your brother is ready. Grandpa showed me a bald star. Stephen, your grandson needs to eat now. You can show him the box car later. <laughs> I love how they're getting along. Do you need help or... Anything? Oh, don't worry. I can do this in the dark. <laughs> but thanks for the offer. All right, all right. Are you boys done playing? We had an express delivery with the passengers. But the engine broke down. Yep, has to go straight to the workshop. Good. No trains in the kitchen, remember? Gotcha, Chief. Choo choo! <laughs> <laughs> so lame. Oh, uh, sugar. He can fix his trains, but not my kitchen. Did I make enough? Everything's okay? It's great, as usual. You're the best cook ever. Looks like you're getting cozy with this new country life after all. <laughs> yeah, it's nice to be far away from everything. Feels like we're the only ones out here. Well, that's exactly why we love it. It feels safe, unlike the big city. I get it. I like it. It's cool here. Well, bless your soul. You'd get along good with our neighbors. We try to lend a hand. Like to Charles next door. He lost his wife, and things have been hard on him and his son. He would just get lost in Seattle. But we're all taking care of him here. 
How old is his son? I, I think he's your age. <gasps> cool. on back there. Nothing. Nothing. Oh, <laughs> I thought Stephen was a fast eater. Hey, Grandma, I wanted to ask you something about that locked room upstairs. I told you there is nothing to see in it, Daniel. Why were you in it this morning, then? Because there's a lot of old junk in there. And Besides, it's not safe for you to explore, okay? This is bullshit. Daniel, language. Why don't you go explore outside? You sure look like you're getting better. Get some fresh air. I'll wait for Sean, and then we'll go. We won't be loud. Promise. But be careful nobody sees you. Stay in the back, okay? Maybe you should tell him that it was Karen's room. And maybe you should tell him to watch his mouth. It's just a room now, Sean. Nothing to see. <sighs> Daniel needs that. He doesn't know anything about her. I know, poor thing. But his mother isn't in there anymore. So nobody goes in the room, okay? I'm serious. Did mom ever contact you? She only talked to dad a few times. Then she was gone. Yes, yeah, she was. And I'm gone. I don't really want to talk about this anymore. It's over, anyway. You have to respect my rules under my roof. Okay. Can't be nosy. Of course. Always. I appreciate that, Sean. Now you better go find your brother. There's a shed with some old toys outside. I'll bet Stephen has the key. Tanny will freak. Thank you. It's cool that Claire does her little paintings. I wonder where this was taken. I don't picture Claire and Steven as world travelers. Where was that picture of you guys on the beach from? Hey, Daniela, how are you? I know. <laughs> it's dad and his silly Santa gringo accent. I completely ignored her. <laughs> How are you, Daniela? I heard Claire rehearse some songs. <laughs> She's got the groove. Sorry for getting upset, Sean. I, I just don't feel comfortable talking about all this. It's, it's fine, really. You're doing good, thank you. And I'm doing okay. It's just really chilly where I'm at. <laughs> I'm trying to finish this game, you know? <laughs> oh, this looks cool. Too bad it's broken. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, don't draw me like this, Sean. I'm a mess. <laughs> don't worry. I'm yeah, very chilly weather. Um, it's so nice to see you cool. practice. I think I'm ready to draw this. Yeah, it's been chilly and it's gonna rain a little bit more tomorrow. Beautiful. <laughs> I 
<laughs> I'll be like, that's it, no more. Time to take the pen, dude. <laughs> Thanks, Daniela. <laughs> hmm. Pretty good. But I can add more details if I want. <laughs> Sean, quick! Look at this fish! It's so beautiful. Dude, come on! I told you there's a fish in it. <laughs> wow. <laughs> I've looked this is in. their grandparents' house. Me. Love. Passion princess? <laughs> Escape to pleasure? Man. Does Claire read all these? Yes, yeah, she does. She's I'm old. She has needs. Up. Gives me something to work on when they're all watching TV. I know it's lame. I know. <laughs> Such a big fireplace. And not even needed. That's luxury. Hey, Claire. What's on your mind, Sean? What did you think of Dad? You can tell me. I won't get mad. Well, your father was... Uh, he was his own person. That's it? I mean, I know you guys didn't well, really get along. It's just... Esteban was very different from us. And he never took a single step to change any of that. Sounds like that. He wasn't one to smooth things over. Trust me. Life is a cougar. <laughs> but he did raise you boys on his own. Can't argue with that. Yeah. He worked his ass off for us. Wish I realized that sooner. Don't worry, Sean. Do you know anything about... Dad's funeral? There was a service. We couldn't make it in time. But we sent flowers. I'm sorry, Sean. It's okay. I just want to make sure somebody took care of him. Hopefully, you can go visit him at some point. Got to. <laughs> at some point. <laughs> oh, depending. Speaking of cougars, Daniela, the cougar killed the dog. Killed Mushroom. What's the story with your neighbor? It killed Charles? Mushroom oh, and and uh and Daniel company. killed the cougar with the tel television. After his wife's passing, he's got a job at the rail yard now. And yeah, I did. Well. He's still recovering. Wow. It's, it's because of I mean, um, their dad, you know. Sad. We tried to give him a hand and keep an eye on his drinking problem. His son Chris is a little angel, though. I think he could be a good influence on Daniel. This boy has spent too much time on the road. Yeah. And I'm not always the best role model. How long have you and Stephen been married? Oh my. Forever. <laughs> but a good forever. <laughs> Almost 40 years. <laughs> That's more than twice my age. You both were married during Y2K. Thanks for making me feel even older. 
I assume you must have a girlfriend, or... I almost started dating this... one person. But I guess... not anymore. I understand. I'm sorry, honey. I want to finish this game so I can put on my pajamas. Because <laughs> I'm cold. <laughs> Well, thanks, Claire. You are very welcome. <laughs> I am cold. It's always a pleasure to speak with my grandsons. Good thing, Grandma. Tried one of Claire's books yesterday. It's basically a telenovela with white old women. <laughs> yes. Man, can you imagine watching a slasher out here? Deep in the woods, no one around. No way. Too scary. You know when though it's a scam. I haven't seen any actual fish in there since we got here. Whoa. Look at all these decorations. That's so So, are you excited about the tree, Daniel? Of course I am. When do we start? I'll get it this weekend. Promise. I better catch up with Steven and get those keys. Okay, Daniel's now going nuts in here. <laughs> hmm. Think I need a handy assistant. Can you hand me the glue in the cupboard behind me? Sure. Whoa! Careful. Sorry, I, I forgot. That thing isn't too stable. Let me just... <laughs> you oh, almost okay. killed me, Grandpa! Sorry, my fault. <laughs> the weather. Your grandma yeah. me, but, uh, See? He almost I killed his own grandson, grandma. you guys. You saw that, right? Uh, can you close the door? I want to talk for a second. Oh. Yeah. Uh, their mom... Uh, that's their mom's grand... Um, yeah, their mom's parents. I think mom le left him, so, yeah. Yeah. So, listen, I've uh, noticed things with Daniel. You know what I'm talking about, don't you? Yeah. They do seem do. shady. <laughs> How the heck is that possible? I mean, he can... Well... You know more than me. Uh, not really. It started in Seattle after... Everything happened. I wish I could explain, but... That's how it is now. And we have to live with it. I, I really don't know what to think. He needs a doctor. Or something. Then I'd probably never see him again. Yeah, I get it. He needs you. More than anything else. And by the way, let's keep this between us. Okay. Claire has a lot of strong beliefs. She wouldn't understand. She adores Daniel, and just wants both of you to be safe and happy. <laughs> what I'm trying he to do say is, maybe you should stay here with us. I know, I know me too. I'm kind of afraid. To Mexico, but... I'm afraid. We have a home in Puerto Lobos. Dad wanted to return there. Two Mexican boys out on the run? <sighs> that won't be a secret in Beaver Creek for long. America is your home. With us. And you have to think about your brother, his future, all that stuff. It's too dangerous for us to stay here. And for you guys, too. 
it's dangerous to be on the road. Do you think your father would have wanted this for his kids? Of course not. But everything's different now. I know. I know. Well, I just want to put on my pajamas. Don't torture yourself. It's cold. I will. Come hey, on. Uh, Finish the game. Claire Come said on. you had the keys for the tool shed. Oh, sure. Here. You guys enjoy the sun. Okay. <laughs> We're gonna lock up and Daniel in the shed, shed now. Probably a mess <laughs> this game is slow. Thanks. It's just like watching paint dry. <laughs> it's good to see you in my lair. You know, you were afraid to come in here as a kid. Really? Huh? Why? No idea. But <laughs> how come you have a disco ball? Are you, like, throwing parties and stuff? No, this is a, a souvenir. You know? I actually met your grandma during a disco night. Believe it or not. Claire <laughs> told me you guys had been married for, like, 40 years, so... It kind of makes sense. Yeah, that sure was a long time ago, but... Uh, we stuck together, you know, through thick and thin. That's cool. Well... That's nice, Grandpa. This is their mom. Yeah, that's their mom. Oh, you found this. I, uh, I just forgot to, uh... It's okay. It's been a while since I've seen her face. That's their mom. Uh, yeah. I like taking a look at it from time to time. Right? <laughs> right? Yeah, it does. But she's still my daughter, you know. I can't approve what she's done, but I, I, I think I understand. Good. I don't. Oh, yeah, I'm sorry, John. Please don't. Uh, please. Don't say anything to Claire about this, okay? Don't worry. I won't. I won't, Grandpa. Stephen sure takes his hobby. I won't, Grandpa. Uh, well, God, I'm sorry, Sean. I know you guys miss your games and your websites. But... Trust me, a, a break from all this can only do me good. You know, it's, it's safe right? That Look yeah. what I've been hiding from you, Claire. Yeah. Look at that. Wow. Is that you? Well, yeah, that was taken when I retired. The mayor came to congratulate me himself. That's awesome. Yeah. Came to Claire. I'm going to talk to you, Claire. Look at what you've done with your father. <laughs> oh, man, who did this? Oh, he was my neighbor's son, Chris. Yeah, I, I helped him and his dad build that treehouse. Why are you holding a fire sword? I'm, I'm not sure. You know, that kid sure has an imagination. <laughs> He's smoking too much weed. Uh, uh. The kid spoke too much, that's why. <laughs> oh, there you are, Sean. Got the key? Hey, I have to go out and run some errands. Can you do me a big favor? Do you know how to work a washing machine? Since I was about eight. Of course. Can you throw in yours and your brother's clothes after the next load? They're in the bathroom basket. Totally, yeah. Um, no problem. Thanks so much. Feel free to keep on tidying your stuff, too. It's good for the health to keep the house clean. Yes, she is. Look at that butt. And, uh, and remember, for your own she's, safety, no she's phone, dummy no thick. internet. She's dummy thick. 
Don't worry, Claire. <laughs> She's dummy thin. Hey, Daniel. There's work for you. Uh, no. I'm busy. D busy my ass. Come over here. <laughs> you gotta find me first. Jeez. See you tonight, buddy. <laughs> That's funny. What's even the point of having so much crockery? Because it's full of crock. <sighs> I don't know when Daniel will be able to go back to his school. As always, always with Claire, Claire, I can't really tell if this is cute or bossy. I have a feeling he's in the, the locked up room. That's what I'm going to go for. I get that he's sick of all this shit, but why are we playing this game? <laughs> it did. <laughs> Man, I miss that dirty Hi, little Michael. dog so much more than I thought I would. Oh. I'm doing okay. I know you're in there. Gotcha. What the? Behind you. Yeah. Very, Very funny. funny. No more hiding. Seriously. Okay, okay. What do I have to do? You tidy the mess in our room, and I take care of the laundry. Cool? <laughs> then, we always have to clean everything. <laughs> yeah, I hear you. That's funny. Never mind, okay? Cool. Thanks, Sean. <laughs> that All was right. funny. Let's get it over with. <laughs> It's like, never hide again, you little shit. <laughs> I'll punch you in your face. I'm just kidding. Alright. Time to take care of that laundry. <sighs> yeah. Thanks, Claire. Yeah. Makes you mu like, uh, Chloe and Max more, yeah. How many programs does this thing have? Okay. It will do. As always with Claire, I can't really tell if this is cute or bossy. Hush, dear husband, if you do, do laundry, please follow these simple rules. Do not mix whites and colors ever. Use one of uh, one cup of detergent. The red box before each load. If you wash my clothes, use the delicate cycle. Do you? You don't. Do you don't? So you don't ruin any more of my clothes. Love wife. Right? <laughs> right? Big time. Boring laundry. Done. Time for fresh air.
Daniel, you ready? We can go out now. Yes. Wait for me. I'll bury him in the snow if you like. <laughs> I do before I get your your ass spanked, dude. We stopped, stopped our training training session since we got here, here, so suck. Get ready for storage wars. What's wrong? Frozen <sighs> shut. Yep. Of course. <laughs> Sean, look. He helped him. We just got here. Are you okay? Uh, yeah. I didn't see anything either. Oh, oh, oh. okay. I just fell down into the snow. Dad says I'm kind of clumsy. That T-shirt is wicked. Who's your favorite superhero? <laughs> I love <Power> Bear. Right? <laughs> oh man. That's funny. I have the Mega Power Bear. You should check it out. So cool. I've got the Chibi Power Bear. The talking one. No, no one, one can, can defeat just, just it. <laughs> Chris, oh God. Look, I, I am so sorry. Are you okay? Dad, I'm fine. I promise. Uh, are you sure? Listen, I shouldn't... Do you know them? It it's okay, Dad. They're cool. He loves superheroes, even Power Bear. Ah, gotcha. Hey there. Are you staying with the Reynolds? Oh, uh, yeah. They're our grandparents. Oh, I see. Oh, jeez, Chris. You don't have any damn shoes on. I'm sorry, buddy. Yep. Let's get you inside. I... How to treat right away to treat a minority, yeah. right? Okay, Dad. <laughs> Thanks, guys. Especially oh, and, uh, if you're Mexican, if American, asks, big time. Tell her everything is fine. Sure. Uh, no problem. Cool. See you around then. Yep. Thanks, guys. See you later. Yes, we will. <sighs> Daniel, did you forget everything about the rules already? Sorry, Sean. Did you want me to let him fall? Really? <laughs> Break his neck. <sighs> no, you... <sighs> you did the right thing. <sighs> but listen... We can't let <laughs> so cringy. Know. Oh, you did the right <laughs> thing. <laughs> but, 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 but. He's like my age. I bet you would have done the same exact thing. Don't be mad. <sighs> I'm not mad, dude. <laughs> it's over. Daniel, remember that we're hiding out. So no training and no showing off your power. From now on, <laughs> you stick with me all the time. Okay. I don't know why I'm playing this game. <laughs> I'm definitely deleting it after this. I, I can't deal with this anymore. I really can't. 
That's fucked up. <laughs> yep, excuse me. Why is he like that? Why are you trying to hump the pillow, dude? Oh, fuck. That kid never listens. Steven? Anybody home? Well, looks like I'm home alone. Oh, right. Sunday morning. Claire and Steven must be at church. Oh, yeah. Church. Yep. So gross. I know. I know. We had a good time decorating the tree together last night. <laughs> it's like, nope. Tanya loved it. Steven and Claire are gonna freak if they realize he went to the Ericsons. Well, I guess they won't be back for... At least two hours. Maybe I could use Steven's laptop. It's been ages since I've had news from the real world. Okay, let's go, Snoop. Jeez. Steven went search crazy on us. Look at this. These articles are almost a month old. Maybe they stopped looking for us? What the hell is this? I had no idea Steven could fall for this <laughs> bullshit conspiracy <laughs> theories. Well, Brody, if we ever make it home, wherever that is, you'll be much, much welcome. Well, this article is much less creepy than it seemed back then. Gee, these articles are almost a month old. Holy shit! Who are these assholes? That's some fucked up hate speech. <sighs> the hell is wrong with Lila? Maybe I should call her while there's nobody home. Why are these assholes? I should really call Lila to check on her. Okay. There you go.
Just a quick call can't hurt us. I need to know if Lily's okay. Hello. Right. Um, Mrs. Park. Yes. Could I talk to Lila, please? Who's asking? It's Sean. Sean. Sean Diaz. Yeah. Is Lila there? Can I talk to her, please? No, you can't. Sorry. What? She's not here. She's in Bellevue. At a clinic. Wait. A clinic? Is she alright? No, she's not. She's having a severe depressive episode. We had to have her admitted last week. To give her time to rest. Oh my. No. Lila. You hurt many people, John. Now please. Don't call here again. I will have to tell the police. Damn. Fuck, oh, Lila. What kind of friend am I? I can't be there for her. Stop thinking about that. Right? <laughs> Time to go get Daniel. Okay. Let's get this brack back home now. It's not their fault. It's not their fault. They didn't do shit. Why does Danny never listen? Maybe I'm doing it wrong. Sounds crazy, but I have a superpower. You saw me yesterday. I know you did. I was flying. I can move things, objects. No, you did. With didn't. my mind. Oh, superpower. Really? Yes. Well, that's pretty cool, Chris. So, you're like a superhero? Um, Captain Spirit, I should have ratted him out. <laughs> I can bend any matter to my will. But that's my secret identity, so you can't tell anybody. Oh, I can keep a secret, Captain Spirit. Now you're an official member of the Spirit Squad. If you betray us, I'll disintegrate you. <laughs> nah, just oh, kidding. Oh, I get it now. Oh, yeah, we need a... Okay. Team Signal. Totally. I'm gonna be uh -huh. super wolf. <laughs> What's your super name, Sean? So cringy. I don't know why I torture myself. <laughs> How about the Silver Runner? Cool. Cool, right? Hmm. Not bad. That's true. You're a great runner. Okay, guys. I think we're ready to roll. As it is. Uh, excuse me. Who are you? I'm Sean. Oh, yeah. Uh, sorry, man. You're here for Daniel. Hey, let's make it official. I'm Charles Erickson. Nice to meet you. Hope you know that Daniel and Chris are a dangerous team. We better watch out, or they're gonna take over the world. Yeah. They share a lot of things. As thick as thieves. Can we go get the Christmas tree now? We're both ready to fly. Yes, yes, yes. The the team has been waiting too long. Hey, you should come along too. There's nothing going on over here. Yes! Can't wait to see all the decorations. And Sean, we could buy Christmas presents for Grandma and Grandpa. Don't worry. Um, I'm breaking the rules. Okay, Fuck this. Sure. I'll go with you guys. Really? <laughs> yeah. Cool. Yeah, I just wish Chris and Daniel were excited about going. Okay, team, uh, 
Give me a time out to clean up the back seat. I'll honk when I'm done. Ooh, uh, can I use the bathroom? Of course. Oh, go see my comic books. I'm glad you're coming too. Hey, you want to see my toys? Oh, score! The new hot dog man? Since you're a new member of the team, you have to know everybody. These are Captain Spirit's friends and his enemies. Dude, that's pretty cool. Can you guess who are the good guys and the villains? Let's see. You sure? <gasps> yep. Careful. It may be tricky. Look closely. The bad guys, the good guys. Not that easy, right? Careful. It may be tricky. Interesting. God damn it, you dumb little kid. The bad guys, the good guys. <sighs> Not that easy, right? I hate this. Interesting. Aren't they all heroes? Okay. How did I do? Not bad. You're almost right. It was a bit tricky. Okay, let me introduce them to you. This is Team Spirit. The good God guys. damn it! There's the Forest Warrior, Power Bear, Marty Rex, and Sky Pirate. So, God fucking who damn are the it! Bad guys? That's <sighs> and the I hate Shock this! Sticker. There's also Snowmancer, but he's out in the garden. But they're all working for Mantroid, who's the real supervillain. So, you tricked me, you stupid little kid! What the fuck? Wait for me. But Captain Spirit and Super Wolf will make Shopping sure the, oh, yeah. doesn't hurt anyone. Yep. <laughs> yeah. Fuck the rules. Strength in numbers. <laughs> Sounds like Mantroid is. Yes, trouble. I Just failed miserably. Sees what Captain Spirit can do now. Yeah. About that. <laughs> um, does your dad know about any of this? Did he see something yesterday? No. He didn't see anything, and the power didn't work yesterday. After I fell. Uh, must have been too tired. Okay, good. Um, I mean, he could be pretty disturbed if he knew. I'm definitely not telling Dad. I don't want to freak him out. He's worried about other stuff anyway. Chris, I'll be right back. Hold on, you guys. It's none of my business, but are you and your dad okay? <laughs> exactly, but I'll be right back, you guys. Um, Claire seems to be worried about you guys. Claire is always worried. We're cool. Totally. He's just... He has a hard time being on his own. That's all. Chris. I know life can get pretty tough. Trust me. But... You'll be okay. You're an awesome kid. Thanks, Sean. But I don't feel scared anymore. I have the power. And I have Daniel. Sorry, the water eater is still broken. There's the signal. Come on, Daniel. Hey! Pro tip. Don't go in there. Yeah. <laughs> okay, squad. Let's roll. 
Oh, cringy. You need my jacket? I don't want you catching another cold. No, I'm good. Thanks. And don't be waving your arms around when I'm driving, okay? <laughs> yeah. Um, remember, Daniel, don't mess around. All right. Okay, buddy. You ready? Yeah. <laughs> hey! You guys go ahead and we'll come back to meet you, okay? Brothers meeting. Sure. What? Don't get lost. Dude, what the fuck are you doing? I can't believe it. How many times do we have to keep going over the rules? Don't show the power. I know. But Chris thinks he can do all this cool stuff. I wish he could. He reminds me of Noah. I just miss having friends, Sean. Alright. I'm gonna go ahead and, um... Uh, let's just protect the stupid secret, I guess. <laughs> I'm back, Listen, you guys. I understand, but we have to be extra careful out here. You can't let people see you. You know the rules. Yes, I know the rules. Yeah, but if I'm you careful. know, if you know the rules, you shouldn't be being a little rules. shit, Daniel. Nobody sees us. Yeah, that's why. <laughs> what if it was Chris's dad, or grandma, or a cop, or? Okay, okay, I get it. But I'm careful. That's not enough. No, you're not. You have Your to little be extra, show off. extra careful. All right, I swear I will. Deal. I'm counting on you, and I know. Can I go see Chris now? Yeah, let's go. But don't forget what I said. Wow. Exactly. Oh, you're right. You're right. <laughs> you're right. <laughs> Like giant cartoons. Creepy. You coming, Sean? Don't worry. I'll be around. Right? He's gonna like say something stupid, watch. Oh, excuse me. How can they sell so many trees in such a small town? Cause they can. Behold, the giant condom machine. <laughs> Sorry, man. I prefer my pine trees a lot. Dad pushed every year to get a plastic tree. <laughs> but we never surrendered. <laughs> Big time. Yep. Welcome to America.
We'll have to tame the one we want. Jeez. That's creepy too. Daniel Snowman wasn't that creepy after all. That's creepy. <laughs> Hi, boys and girls. <laughs> I'm Snowman. <laughs> Fucking creepy ass snowman. I don't like you. I don't like you. Let's look at another one. <laughs> no thanks. <laughs> I don't want it ripping my head off. <laughs> Looks like someone went nuts over these blocks. I wonder what will happen to the trees no one buys. Dear Santa, Snowman lives matter. <laughs> Please explain this hot mess. Dear Santa, kids this year. Please explain this hot mess. This is so different from Seattle. I don't Beaver know if Creek. I can get used to it. Is that a yo-yo? Daniel had one back home. Bet he loved this. This guy is looking over here. Better not try anything yet. Nope. Man. It would have been so cool to have one of these before coming here. <laughs> Claire and Steven definitely have a king for Christmas. Pet that like these. I got to wait until, you know. Got to wait. Hi, everybody. We're taking a year off to run away from cops. Daniel has got telekinesis now. <laughs> Hope you're doing well. We only sell handmade local products. Come take a look. <laughs> I'll get a beaver. <laughs> Give him a snowman. You won't find better deals in Beaver Creek. Oh, that beaver is cute. Okay. But I only have, I only have a dollar. I only have, I'm like, I'm mom, 97 cents short. I'm 97 cents short. <sighs> we only sell handmade local products. Come take a look. I can't afford it. See? I cannot afford it. <laughs> you won't find better deals in Beaver Creek. Hey. Hi. Good morning, young man. It's nice to see a new face in this old town. Thanks. It's a... Super cool market you got here. Small towns are the best for Christmas. Who are you staying with? Um, uh, the Reynolds? Everybody knows Stephen. He was Beaver Creek's fire chief years ago. Uh, you're not his grandson, are you? Yes, I am. Oh, that's great. He told me about you, but um, that was a long time ago. <laughs> it's been a few years, right? Yeah. Family stuff. I bet. Anyway, uh, look around. And if you find anything you want, I'll give you the special Reynolds discount. Ooh! Move! I want the beaver! We sell handmade local products. Come take a look. Move! I want the beaver! Move! Get out of my way, 
Hey, assholes. Okay. Better find a right? date for Daniel quick. While he's God. still busy with Chris. Whoa! You won't Give find me the better deals in Beaver Creek. I'll get the beaver. Holy shit. Funny how all small towns always sell the same handcrafted crap. Okay, I'll pick the beaver. Ugh. It's weird to have all this food around after a month of ravioli diet. Okay. Now I want to pick the. You won't find better deals in Beaver Creek. Give me move! I want to pay for it. Give me the beaver. Give me the beaver. I want the beaver. Give me the beaver. There. We only sell handmade local products. Come take a look. There. Hey, can I have one of these beavers? I know that's kind of scary yep. to know that you know everybody. Rose. And of course, you get the friendly price. There, I got to the beaver, the Daniela. Oh, I got the beaver. Cool. <laughs> Thanks. Sorry, I I think. Here you go. Thanks. Now I got three cents left. Anything else? No. I'm good. Have a nice day then. Yeah, you too. Thanks. Cool. Welcome. Mission accomplished. <laughs> we better leave now. Now all my stream, when somebody that. replays my stream, they're gonna be like, "What is he? What is she yelling about? The what about a beaver?" Hmm. Hi. Quiet morning. This is a nice collection. <laughs> Why? Thank you. I make them all myself. Whoa. Must be a lot of work. <laughs> Definitely too much for the money they get me, yes. Do you have another job? <laughs> Obviously. <laughs> Wouldn't last a month if I relied on handcrafts to make a living. The mall That's has funny. I'll put the condom on. Like, here you go. Can't Strap on a willy. And people seem surprised unemployment is going through the roof. I know. Sucks. But we can't do anything about it. Right? I like to think there's always a solution, however frustrating that thought can be. Anyway, you've got better things to do than listening to an old lady ranting about capitalism, right? That's cool. Don't worry. Well, thanks for hearing me out anyway. Can I get a free wreath? You have a nice day. Did I lock the shop yesterday? Hmm. <sighs> Shit. Definitely not my budget. I got no money. And I can't use, I can't steal that yo-yo, so. <laughs> Whoa. The guy who painted that must have been seriously high. I will. Look, he's gonna put his thing. Here you go. Now I wanna draw. <laughs> I'm gonna put a con and be like, oh, this is a, this is a snowman. <laughs> Beavers. Cool. Beavers. I think I'm ready to draw this. <laughs> Time to take the pen, dude. 
This place is nice. Push it down the party and around and around hmm. it. Oh. Pretty good. But I can Joy to the world, our teacher's dead. We barbecued okay. her Got head. It. What happened to her body? We flushed it down the potty and around and around it goes and around and around it goes and around it goes so we cut her down. Okay, I'll stop. <laughs> I've looked enough. Time to draw now. What are you drawing? Whoa, it's so cool. Are you like a professional? <laughs> no. Shut up, Macaulay Culkin. More like the opposite. <laughs> you can draw comic books. The awesome adventures of Captain Spirit and Super Wolf. <laughs> Pretty rad for Hollywood man. <laughs> yeah. I'll think about it. Hey, can you add something funny to your drawing? Funny? Like what? Uh, I don't know. <laughs> Something cool. Uh, okay. Big question. Zombies or UFO? Mm, what about a giant spaceship flying over Beaver Creek? <laughs> right? Cool. I think I'm ready to draw this. Seriously, I need not. I don't need. I need to be less sober on this. I hope I can draw like you one day. I'm sure you will, man. <laughs> I'm not sober for this, you guys. <laughs> if I wasn't sober, I think I would enjoy it more. <laughs> be detached from it, you know. <laughs> It's me, it's me, come hey. to take my do Something cool for once. I can give you condoms. Safe sex is always good. <laughs> Pretty cool. I I just <laughs> relax, dude. It's cool that you listened. People are usually too busy to care. You recognize her voice? You recognize her voice? <laughs> you have a great voice. Uh, you should be on one of those singing shows. That's kinda nice. Not really my thing though. I hate TV and show business shit. Well, you recognize your voice. And good luck. See ya. Just give it. I'm gonna give you the food.
Ugh. It's weird to have all this food around. A month of ravioli diet. Why don't you give me the money? I miss Dad's Christmas at all. I think Daniel has enough broken toys. Come on, I want to give her food. Too bad we can't come and see. Maybe we'll get some leftover pies and eggnog, at least. It's not much, but she probably needs it more than me right now. Hey. Hey. Miss me already? What? what? Uh, <laughs> no, I mean... I'm just messing with you. It's nice to chat for a change. Me and my friends have been crashing here for the wait. Nobody gives a shit about us. Yeah, I can tell you're not from around here. Now we are. Kinda. That sounds... complicated. Trauma? Yeah. <laughs> Lots. I'll huh. give her the condoms. Yeah, I hear that. Way too much. What about you and your friends? Start dancing. Road trip? Uh, <laughs> not really. <laughs> we kind of hop from place to place, hunting for little jobs. <sighs> Must be a long ride. That's okay. We hop on trains. Gives us time to rest. Man, that sounds wicked. You have no idea. It's free and so fucking fun. Well, unless you get caught or fall, but we've been lucky so far. That's the best. Nobody tells us what to do. No corporation owns us. And you get to see so many cool places. Exactly. Next stop is Humboldt County, California. <laughs> Stoner break. Not even close. We actually got work over there. Sean, what are you doing? We've hit the tree with Chris. It's all crooked like an old witch. Oh, hi. Who are you? Ooh, your hair looks so cool. Is it a witch? <laughs> uh, well, what do you think? Mm, I don't know. But it's really cool. I'm Daniel. What's your name? Hi, Daniel. I'm Cassidy. I dig your superhero outfit. I'm on a secret mission with my friend. It's very dangerous. I can tell. I hope you get your mission accomplished. <laughs> and what's your name? You're like, dance, bitch. Oh, Just kidding. Uh, Sean, I... I thought I told you. Now you did. Sorry, you went through some shit with the guys. How much you make? You ready? Hello, pups. Ooh, is that your doggy? So cool. Yeah, he's been through a lot. Like most of us. So we adopted him. And he stinks. Yeah, you stink and you like it, huh? <laughs> Well, he's not the only one. Have you checked your hair? I think it just twitched. You should keep your distance, dude. She looks really cool, I think. See? He knows I'm clean. You're the nasty one. Yeah, you always go for those suburban boys. Are you kidding? You want to talk about your scoreboard, Hotshot? Yeah, hey, should have gave him the condoms, no too. You're right about Come that. On, let's bail. It was nice meeting you, Sean and Daniel. Stay out of trouble, kids. Bye. Hope we see you on the rails someday. Yeah. See you around. That doggy was so cute. I miss Mushroom. I miss her, too. Hey, excuse me. Dogs have to be on a leash around here. Too many strays. <laughs> Sorry, dude. 
We don't do leashes. Well, the city does. An unleashed dog is liable to a fine, so... Uh, you're gonna fine our dog? Well, that's not very nice. Loitering is illegal, too. And you don't live here, right? Right? Calm down, sweetie. We're allowed to visit the Christmas market. Our dog's not gonna eat you. Oh, I love this dog. Can I keep the dog, Daniela? You punks are Can we keep the dog, Daniela? <laughs> this is a nice town, okay? Jeez. Someone needs to get laid. You got the condoms for <laughs> He's out of pills. That's it. I'm calling the cops. <laughs> oh, God. He's gonna call the cops on us, Finn. Chill out. We're leaving this shithole anyway. You guys don't even have a Santa, for Christ's sake. <laughs> <laughs> Merry Christmas. Fucking parasites. Why did they fight? I don't get why he yelled like that. You should kick his ass, Sean. <sighs> prank him! Prank him! We're gonna prank him, yeah. bitch! We're what gonna prank him! Maybe this guy needs a shower. You know? To cool him down. <laughs> You're right. Hold on. You prank him, bitch! We're gonna prank that bitch! Right, Daniela? This will teach him. Nice. <laughs> Come on. They're pretty. Okay, I'm still the oil now. I I know it sucks, but Daniel deserves it too. Right? The best Christmas wreaths are here. Decorate your front doors with something truly special. Okay, let's go. Let's get the get the hell out of here. We get the hell out of here. <laughs> Seems like Charles is waiting for us. We should get going. Hey, you guys ready to go? Yeah. All done. Cool. <laughs> Hop in. Are you having too much fun back there? Yeah. It's not safe! Look, Danielle, it's not safe! <laughs> I'm glad that you guys are here. Thank you for watching this cringe, cringe um, show, you guys. Thank you for being here. I appreciate it. I really do. Even though it's long and and really like cringy, thank you guys for making it less cringy for me. <laughs> if you fell asleep, Daniela, it's okay. like Daniel found a new brother. <laughs> no kidding. He dumped me like a rock. I'm glad you two came along. It's great that Chris found a new friend out here. It looks like you did too. What's her name? Um... Cassidy? Cassidy. Cute name. <laughs> Do you like her? She was cool. You too quick! Ah, anyway, got ya. <laughs> it's good for me to get out too. We've had a rough time over the past couple of years. My wife Emily, she died two years ago. Dang. Obviously, it was tough on Chris. Shit. Um, I'm sorry, man. Thanks. It's been a struggle, especially trying to be a good dad.
Do you have some kind of problems? I'm just not the man I was. I shouldn't have even brought this up, you know, just forget it. No worries. Didn't mean to make you feel bad. We all have our ups and downs, right? That's how life works. Your grandparents sure did have their share of downs, too. But they're always there for us. For Chris. They seem like good people. Yeah, my... My mom left my dad a long time ago. She... never came back. She broke all ties with her parents, too. Sorry for bringing that up. It's okay. I hope they don't stress out because we haven't come back. Uh, yeah, we should get you two home. Uh, don't keep them waiting. Yeah. <laughs> Christmas tree? Yeah! Well, I'll get there before you with my dad. <laughs> no way you can beat Captain Spirit. <laughs> See you later, Super Wolf. <laughs> That's so lame. Hello? Hello? Claire? Uh oh. Steven? Looks like Grandma and Grandpa haven't come back from church yet. Well, at least they won't yell at us for going out. That was so cool to spend time with Chris at the market. Did you know Chris's mom was an artist? I didn't. How so? She drew comics. You should see her drawings. They're so cool. Just like yours. Thanks, dude. Hey. Uh. What? What is it? Sean? I want to go check on the room. Upstairs. I know it's Mom's. Please. You won't give up on that, right? It's just. I really want to know what's inside. What kind of stuff she had. Chris has tons of things that belong to his mom. And I have nothing. Oh my Sean. god. Let's try it. You don't even have to come with me. If you don't want to. <sighs> Fuck it. I'll come with you. So See you what their mom made. You know? Find a way to open it. Or I could just blow this stupid door up with my power. That looks super easy. <laughs> yeah, I could do that with a hammer. But let's try and find the key instead, all right? I'm just gonna clean up real quick. <sighs> Locked door. Maybe key to Karen's room is inside. Who knew this sweet little muffin would turn into such a brat? Still super cute, though. Karen hated collecting trinkets. She used to say they were just useless dust traps. Hated collecting trinkets. She used to say they were... <laughs> <laughs> Love the outfits, guys. Man, he looks so different. Look at that. <laughs> so young. <laughs> Let's do this, you guys. Yeah, no. No way I'm searching Claire's underwear. Granny panties. Sharp objects. <laughs> Bit like Claire. Hey, Helly, how you doing? <sighs> Come on, little key. Don't be shy. Thank you. Definitely not the one. 
way too small. But let's see what it opens. <laughs> How much more Irish can you be? Wonder what would have been different if Dad had taken us to church. I'm doing okay. Trying to finish no this game. Even though I'm on the second episode. I guess it kind of makes sense. Whoa, I'm just looking for a key, not the crown jewels. Ew, are these milk teeth? I'm not sure if it's gross or cute, but still, no key here. Well, I'm doing okay, thank you. Um, just been trying to finish this game, you know. Okay, Steven. Where do you hide this key? I don't really see Steven listening to old school pop rock music. We oh, you do? Don't share politics <laughs> That's much. cute. At least Steven doesn't preach. That's cute. Yeah, not much to see in here. But what's Milk Teeth, anyways? Clothes, old stuff, <sighs> definitely no hidden key. Oh. Shit, these are Christmas presents? Let's not tell Daniel, or he'd freak. Okay, nothing in here, so close. So what is milk teeth? Oh. Oh. Oh, okay. Now I get it. Oh, okay, okay. Oh, gotcha. <laughs> this whole house is pretty much a huge washing machine. Uh. Okay, Daniel. Uh. Think hard. What was she wearing? Um, jeez. I think it was that weird, uh, sweater thing. Dude, Daniel, you really... We have to get into that room before they come back. Daniel, you really think you could open... Yep, it's empty. Gotta check. Let me go last. <sighs> Gotta find a way to open that door. Or Daniel's okay. gonna keep ranting about it. Okay. <sighs> we have to get into that room. Before they come back. Okay, well, I'm trying. Come on. Jesus. Where is this card again? Oh. No way she wore it to church. Okay, uh, closet. Clothes. Yeah, he is. Stuff. <sighs> yeah, Definitely he's starting to annoy me too. That's why I'm trying to finish this game. Hey. I think that's the cardigan Claire was wearing yesterday. Yes. Okay, we found the stupid key. Okay, I found hurry up. One key, so it better fit. Just try it. Oh, the reason you don't want to play the game? Yeah, I bet. I can't wait to finish this game and install it. <laughs> There's not that much left. Where do you think they put the rest of her stuff? It's her teenage room. I'm sure she... 
I see. Sorted through her things before leaving for Seattle. The rest is... They want to forget anything related to Karen. <laughs> I can relate. The rest is probably packed in these boxes. I think I saw a moon eclipse once. Before Daniel was born. Never been a big fan of hiking. But here I was. I miss my skateboard. And going to the park. With Lila. Karen liked to take pictures of strangers when we walked down the streets. I think it's not plugged. Okay, Daniel. You've seen everything you wanted to see? Claire and Steven will be home soon now. Just... Read a lot of these in the 10th grade. Yawn. Guess the no phone rule wasn't such a thing back then. Okay. Hmm. Oh, I see. That's how mom... Man, that pen pal sure loved listening to her own voice. I don't know. I don't think she used any perfume. From what I remember. Oh. Yeah. You finally left forever. All right, let's go. Coward. Okay. Let's go, let's go. I miss not having any memories of her, Sean. They looked happy. How could she send all of this to hell? all the pictures. I think I remember that one. Karen showed it to me once. I see. You... Ulysses? Hey, Daniel. Check this out. His name is Ulysses. Like... The hero? I guess. So cool. It's like... She almost never used those. Hi, Ulysses. These pictures are so... random. Is that an amethyst? She was into New Age bullshit. Okay. This playlist is boring as hell. You were a friend of my mommy's? Hope you enjoyed your trips. So you didn't bail on us for nothing. I don't recognize any of these games. All right, let's go. Did she take you with her when she went on trips? Oh man, I want to get out of there. Why would no, Claire lock these up in here? Don't want to get in trouble. Is that for mom? Let's check to tell me huh? why. Let no. me see. Daniel. Oh, I see. Come on. What's it say? Read it. Seriously, stop. Here, how about this? I've heard the news about Seattle. Please help my boys if they come to you. What? Why did they hide this from us? I don't know. You can reach me at, at this address. It's a P.O. box I use sometimes. What's a P.O. box? Well, a cop-out in this case. I beg oh, I see. You, please help my sons. Oh, yeah, right. Total bullshit. What do you mean? She cares about us. Well, I don't. Maybe she changed her mind. We could try and contact her. Shut you up, her, okay? Daniel. You're a little don't annoying. Wrong ideas. Yeah, he's we starting to annoy me now. Stick to our plan. <laughs> trying to ignore his I ass. Know. Can I read it again? Yeah. Then we gotta go. My goodness. Oh. Shit. Excuse me. What are you both doing in here? Except visibly. Ransacking our house while we're at church. 
Claire, we're sorry, but we just wanted to... No one ever told you that everything you say before a butt has no value? You know you shouldn't be in here. Claire, please, calm down. No, Stephen. They went way out of line here. We specifically told you to stay out of this room. right to see my mom's room. This isn't her room anymore. There is nothing to see in here. It's time you learn to respect some rules. Oh, God. Actually, we did find something. Yeah, we found a new letter from my mom. She said she wants to see us. But you didn't even tell us. She's not my daughter anymore. Or your mother. She burned all those bridges. One letter doesn't change what she did to me. All of us. She is not welcome back. No. It's been eight years. Maybe it's time to move yeah. on. Don't you dare lecture me, Sean. You don't know anything about how I feel. I can't hear that. Yeah, Rand, Steven. Listen, Sean. I know life has been tough on you the past month. Bless your souls. And, and we put up with a lot of things. But that, going through our stuff, our personal belongings, oh, that shows you don't respect us. Then you act like I'm the bad guy, after what we've done for you. I knew something like this might happen. Maybe you two staying here wasn't such a good idea. Man, I think I see why Mom left now. She couldn't put up with your stupid rules anymore. Oh, so that's what you think. Then let me tell you something. Huh? <gasps> Steven! Oh, no. Oh, shit! Get this goddamn thing off me! Steven, no! Hold on, honey, we'll get it off! Help! No. Stop! Oh, my oh. legs! I have to! Do it, Daniel! Now! No. Do what? What's going on? Oh Lord, what what are you doing, Daniel? I just, I just can't, I have no choice. If there's a lift, it's not gonna help. Jesus. I hate playing new games. Oh my baby, Stephen, are you okay? No, I am. Thanks to Daniel. See, the you grandfather right. has more respect for me. I should have fixed that cupboard months ago. I guess my laziness will get me someday. What in the name of God was that all about? That's impossible. What are you, Daniel? Claire. Listen, they saved me, Claire. That's all that matters. Maybe. It was a miracle. Thank you, Lord. Oh, no. It's the sheriff. Sean, I didn't. We didn't call him. I know, Grandma. Sean, what are we gonna do? Go hide in the garage. No, no, no way. You gotta hide. The police searches the house. That makes the two of you accomplices. Get your bags and go out the back door. I'll distract him. Really? Yes. Yeah, he is. Yeah, she is. Get the hell out of here. I like Steven. Steven's cool. He knew. I'm so sorry for everything. I wish we could have helped you more. I wish you could stay here with us. Watch out for your brother, Sean. Yes. Be careful. We'll see you as soon as we can, okay? 
Thanks for helping us. Mushroom died. Their dog got killed and I got sad. What the hell? Move your ass, bro. Oh, shit. Thank you. This way. Like, okay. Okay, well, this game is a little cringy, just letting you know. <sighs> Man. I'm like, ugh. You must be so mad at me. I could tell he was pissed when he saw I had the power. You get over it. Yeah, it is. You saved his life. He, he thinks I'm a liar now. He's a smart kid. Daniel's He's annoying. Not stay mad. You guys are the spirit squad, right? I hope so, Sean. I'm tired of running away. Why does my power always bring trouble? You don't have to use your power if you don't want to. But I'm good with it. And I'm the only one who can do these things. I know, but Daniel, you need to be careful and listen to your brother. You think we'll see Grandma and Grandpa again? I don't know. We'll see. Where are we gonna go now? See... See, Mom? No way, man. We oh, man, I'm sorry okay, to hear but... that. I hope you have a good day at work. She wanted to find us. We stick to the plan. We go to Puerto Lobos. That's where we belong. Puerto Lobo. No one will tell us what to do. We can be whoever we want. You, you think? I don't know. Trust me, man. From now on, <laughs> we make our own rules. Look, I even got you a present. Merry Christmas, Enano. For real? See, Danielle, if you're still here, I'll give you. I'll give it to weeks. the beaver. Who cares? Dates are boring. Here. It's all for me? Hello, beaver! Look, I got a beaver. And a yo-yo. Awesome. The beaver! This is the best. Hey. I got something for you two. <laughs> he got the discount. It, but... We're doing it now, so. Oh, man. That's so cool. <laughs> he should have finished the leg. Listen. There's a ride. Come on. 
All aboard. It was handmade. It was ten dollars. I had nine dollars, and then the person was friendly and gave me a discount, so it was nine bucks for that beaver. And I only had a late a, a, a girl. Be continued. Finally, it's over. Finally, it's over. Sorry guys for the long cringy stuff, you know. <laughs> exactly. Me too, but never really like country music, but yeah, it gives you that uh 
the, the Last of Us vibes, y'all. Yeah. But the soundtrack for um, for uh, The Last of Us is really nice, though. Lot of babies. Oh, no, I didn't yet. My boyfriend sh usually tells me, but when is the demo coming out, um, Heli? Yeah, I've been this. This is the second episode, and yeah, I'm gonna end it because I've been on it for uh, for almost three hours. Yeah. Oh, they just said soon. Okay. Yeah, uh, Gail, it's, 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 the, the episode's over. <laughs> and it's already almost 10.30 for me, and I'm a little sleepy. But, yeah, I want to play the, the, the remake already, you know? And I still need to finish playing, um, Dead Space Remake. I need to do that, too. Thank you, Renee. I thought you left. I know you fell asleep too, because I know you work. In a month. Yep. They did what they're doing in, um, for the remake of 2 and 3. And they're doing the dodgy mechanism like 3, like the original. 
which is good because because in the original game I like four Resident Evil four is my other my other uh favorite game uh yeah it's better because yeah oh you're off work tomorrow nice nice sounds good yeah they did they did and they butchered three remakes so bad I was so mad they cut everything out and it was so short it was so short, man. And I hope Resident Evil 4 Remake does not disappoint me like they did for 3. I'll be super pissed off. <laughs> nice. Okay, good. I hope not. I, I hope not. <laughs> because they butchered four, three really bad. I'm okay. I'm just tired. I've been playing a lot. Yes. There's a new... They added a new... Uh, a new uh, enemy. That's what I heard, uh, Heli. I know. That's going to be fun. gonna be fun see in honor mm. because uh, four had its own mercenaries yes it's a very long credit yes See, I'm already bored. It's like so much. But next one, I will definitely, uh, um, I'll definitely, uh, uh skip it. Yeah, first person is a little dizzy. It's a little wonky. I hope so too because I just want to play the game and I want to say that Resident Evil 4 Remake was really great and it was kind of just like the original 4 
But I do want to see Cold Veronica in a remake because I love Cold Veronica. <laughs> it was difficult to play though, but I hope they change everything, you know? Because Cold Veronica is another favorite game of mine. My my top five uh, games of Resident Evil I like is uh, Original 2, uh, 4, Code Veronica, Nemesis, and, uh, well, 6. I like Original 2, I like Original 4, I like Remake 4, I like, uh, Original 3, Nemesis, Good night, Renee, and I like Remake of, uh, Remake of 2 and Code Veronica. That's all my top 6. No, that, and one. Original one as well. Well, seven, because I like the ori I like the original one. I like the original remake. Two, original two is the top for one. I like original th three. I like Code Veronica. And I like the original, the remake of two. Alright, have a good night, Renee. Super cold and my feet hurt, my legs hurt. Oh. See what kind of snacks I have. <laughs> I'm up a little bit, you guys. Dang. Okay, it's almost over. <laughs> ah, yeah, he was all right, but you know, I give I give props to Steve. Yeah. Well, it's just the the probably the Canadian voice actor, you know. Period. Yeah. Through Snowball, Daniel. You let Daniel kill the cougar. Have a good night, Helly. So, this is it? Yeah. It looks like a nettle field. And it stinks. <laughs> yeah. And your stinky feet will cover the smell. Shut up. They don't. Come on. I'll show you around. That is it, you guys. Life is Strange 2, Episode 2 has been 
has been completed. If you're new, go ahead and subscribe. Hit that notification bell. Um, make sure, If you're new, go ahead and give it a like. Give it a dislike. It's okay. Comments, please keep it courteous and respectful. And I will continue on with, the, with episode 3. God, I hope this is not too long. And I want to finish this game. So I will see you guys soon. And until the next one, you guys stay... Uh, stay safe, stay warm, stay healthy, um, have a good night, a uh, good morning, evening, afternoon, wherever you're at, be safe you guys, until the next time, bye guys.